Our chlorination system is like having your own water processing plant. Look, chlorine is dangerous, there's no doubt about it. Um, to offer additional protection, we're using calcium hypochloride that does not have stabilizer. So swimming pool chlorine isn't necessarily um, something that's in your best interest. Uh, we believe that a tablet chlorinator, as you'll see on, on, on our site, uh, offers you a piece of equipment that doesn't have the problems that uh, liquid chlorine has. It doesn't have a proportionating pump and all the breakdowns. It's very simple to use. Once in a while requires cleaning uh, with a brush and water, but that also is a simple process. Um, chlorination system is like having your own water processing plant, so that's going to remove iron, sulfur, bacteria. Uh, it is going to give you a refreshing drinking water from your well, removing actually over 250 contaminants as well. Chlorination since World War II has been the best germicidal that we've had. I think um, old technology uh, as opposed to ozonation and some of the other newer things on the market is the way to go. Uh, it's established, it's successful. For the dollar, um, comparing it against, say, green sand, which removes iron, but that's it. Peroxide, which removes bacteria, but that's it. So our system is going to give you, for the dollar spent, uh, a high-quality water without the bacteria, without the iron, without the sulfur. So I, I believe that chlorination is the way to go, and I think you'll find that our system is about the easiest to maintain. Price-wise, because we design, we build, uh, we install, we also do our own warranty work, uh, you'll find us to be probably about a half to a third the price of our national competition. We offer an extended good warranty program. Um, I think you'll be pleased with our chlorination system. We've been doing it for the past 21 years. I certainly have made some improvements within it, but it's been a very successful system for us on, uh, on wells. It is a simple process of chlorinating, sending it to a retention tank, which is an opportunity for the water to contact uh, with the chlorine so it kills the bacteria. Iron's also heavier than water, so it's going to settle to the bottom of that tank. You will notice on our pictures that there's a clean-out valve on the bottom. That means that once a month you'll open it up and you'll find that iron comes out because it has settled to the bottom because it's been in contact with the chlorination. Keep in mind that peroxide is a, a non-separatable uh, non material, which means it bonds to the water. So that means you can't separate it. Once you use peroxide, you're going to drink it, however you feel about that. But, uh, so what we're doing is taking the chlorinator to a retention tank and, of course, the final tank, which is, to me, the most important, whether it's city water or whether it's well, is an oxidation tank. We have probably close to 100 pounds of carbon in that system, along with KDF and some other media beds, but it's going to oxidize out the tool, the chlorine that we originally put in there to purify the water. So you've got your own water processing plant. A softener? Softener is optional. Uh, with the three-piece system, you're going to remove iron, sulfur, bacteria. That's a primary concern for most. However, you can add a softener to it. We have a softener that is specifically designed for the well. It has a C100 resin in it, which is a smaller resin designed to pick up calcium and iron off of a well. Um, we make a package deal on that, so you can inquire directly with us or a salesperson. Um, our phone number uh, and email address, of course, are on the site. So, like I say, it's a three-piece system. You'll find that to be very successful. Uh, the softener is icing on the cake. If you, so to speak, want to add a softener to it, then it's going to take the three-piece system and additionally remove calcium on top of that. Hey, look forward to talking with you. Thanks for watching.